What up guys, the Crypto Homie, back at you with another video. Today, we're gonna to be talking about Kusama, KSM, and uh, looking over the current price action in the, in the Bitcoin space. But before we get into it, make sure you subscribe to stay up to date on the latest in the crypto space. So let's first just check out the current price action in the market. As you guys can see, we're, it's a little bit of red in here, you know, just single digits, one to 3%. And we got some like occasional green, but look at that. Lend up 23%. You know, we got a uh, OMG's down 10% right now, but still hanging in at 560. So it's not too bad. Just got, you know, we got some that are 10% negative, 10% positive, but uh, for the most part, we see it slightly negative. And as you guys can see, Kusama up 54%. So let's dive right into that. It's like, what's going on there? Let's uh, check out market cap, total supply, all that good stuff, and we'll check out their website. So as you guys have seen on a previous live stream, I like looking at CoinMarketCap and CoinGecko because there's like their numbers are slightly off. So we'll see, uh, you know, what's more accurate. So on CoinMarketCap, they says that the total market cap of KSM is 234 million. And then when we go over to CoinGecko, it says 248 million. So once again, that's off, you know, by a little bit. And the circulating supply on CoinGecko says 8.9 million you know, and some change with a total supply of 10 million. Coin market cap says 8.4 million and some change with a total of 8.6. So it's kind of interesting that, uh, you know, why isn't the total supply at least the same? Um, so I guess it depends where they get their numbers from. But on coin market cap, I see the all time high. All time high is $20 and 15 cents. And that's actually the all time high is today. So it hit $20 and 15 cents today. So guys, this is at an all-time high, and uh, let's just go check out CoinGecko, see if they have the same all-time high. It says twenty-eight dollars and one cent. So yeah, and uh, I would assume that's also today because it's at twenty-seven dollars and seventy cents, up fifty-seven percent on CoinGecko. So it's making some moves. So let's dive right into their website. I thought this was interesting, guys. It literally says a polka dot experiment. Expect chaos. No promises. It does say polka dots wild cousin. That's what I was waiting for. Polka dots wild cousin, guys. That's interesting because I did make a video about, po about polka dot and, uh, and it seems like an interesting project. So let's just keep on going here. It says the scalable multi chain network for radical innovation. So if you guys know anything about polka dot, it's like Web3. I have a video about that. You guys can uh, like check it out. But um, so this. Seems kind of interesting. If they're trying to uh, be the wild cousin, that sounds uh, it sounds like they're gonna have an interesting project. L like, let's see if they can e like execute on that. So they're saying unprecedented interoperability and scalability for blockchain developers who want to quickly push the limits of what's possible. Built using Substrate with nearly the same code base and industry-leading multi-chain infrastructure as Cosmos cousin Polkadot. Interesting, like let's see if they can pull it off. The origin of, of Cosma. The relationship between society and technology has deteriorated to the point where large entities routinely stretch and overstep their authority. Kusama is a network built as a risk taking, fast moving canary in the coal mine for its cousin Polkadot. <laughs> that, it's kind of a nice analogy right there. It's a living platform built for change agents to take back control, spark innovation, and disrupt the status quo. So this kind of reminds me of like a rebel, you know, if they're trying to do innovative things that uh, breaks the current rules to a certain extent, you know, the gray area. It says, what is Kusama? Kusama is a scalable network of specialized blockchains built using substrate and nearly the same code base as Polkadot. The network is an experimental development environment for teams who want to move fast and innovate on Kusama or prepare for development on Polkadot. So guys, this kind of just reminds me of like Bitcoin forks, how they basically take the code of Bitcoin and then create, slightly change it, and then kind of how like like kind of how like Litecoin is. They'll typically test things out on Litecoin before they put it on Bitcoin. Um, so this is kind of cool. It seems like the, you can test things out on Kusama before you want to try it on on Polkadot. And then Kusama was founded in 2019 by Gavin Wood, founder of Polkadot and co-founder and former CTO of Ethereum. That's interesting. CTO of Ethereum. If you guys aren't aware, Ethereum is the number one, the number two crypto. So, launch your own custom blockchain. 
So it has fat, fast in, iterations, uh, low economic barriers, advanced technology, open governance, engaged community. They definitely have a big community, uh, valuable experience. So there's, they're definitely trying something here. Like, let's see if they can, uh, can make it happen. And I'd say their website is definitely interesting. I, I, like, I definitely like when I see stuff like bring and then they have words that change, especially when I said, you know, polka dots, wild cousin. That definitely uh, was something I had to show you guys. You know, they're, they're like they're going for innovation. Kusama is built by the same teams. Oh, I guess the same teams as Polkadot using nearly the same code and tools. The network places the latest tech from the parity technologies and Web3 foundation in the hands of developers, even before those features make it to Polkadot. So it seems like with Kusama, there's probably going to be a lot of highly speculative um, developments that may or may not work on Polkadot, but they're just testing it out here. The scalability. Oops. Kusama's sharded blockchains and open governance provide a scalable and future proof of infrastructure for businesses, marketplaces, and applications to, to deploy and mature. That's always good. The interoperability. Kusama brings multi blockchains together into one sharded network, freeing developers from the silos created by legacy blockchain networks. Customization. So with Substrate, the developers can build their own app-specific blockchain and connect it to, to Kusama. That's interesting. As it seems like they have some, like something going on here. Let's see if they can execute on it. But scrolling back up, the Canary network. I mean, it's uh, it's it definitely it, like this whole thing right here is pretty cool. The Polkadot experience. Basically, it just sounds like it's, it's a, kind of like a test net for, for Polkadot. And Polkadot was uh with, with, like with, like had some pretty good price action, so we shall see what like what goes on here. You know, up fifty percent, guys. That's you know you toss a hundred bucks in, and now it's worth one hundred fifty. And you can do the math. You toss a thousand in, you know, ten thousand, etc. But with the with the market cap of two hundred around two hundred thirty four million dollars, the volume for the twenty four hours in Coin Market Cap is around forty one million. I did want to check out Coin Gecko's volume. Of 43 million, so that's uh, it's very similar. It's closer than than the market cap. So, alrighty, guys, what do you guys think about Kusama? You know the KSM. Let me know down in the comments below. And is there any other coins you guys are like are checking out right now? Let me know down in the comments. And as always, homies, this is not financial advice. This is just pure entertainment. Invest at your own risk. I'd like to thank you for watching the video. Smash the like button if you liked it, and subscribe for more content. Crypto homie is signing out.